Now, Decatur is another city in Benton County that was hit hard by those Sunday morning storms. That's where we find Fox 24's Brianna Moore live there. Dan, uh, Brianna, what are you seeing there in Decatur? Well, I am standing in front of what used to be the home of the Tao family. They tell me that they actually had family in from Minnesota when this storm took place Sunday morning. Now, I'm going to take a step back so you can get a better view of the house. But they tell me that they had several family members in from out of town when they got the alert on their phone that the tornado was actually headed to Decatur and they ran to their pantry. Now, the significant part about them all cramming in, all six of them cramming into this pantry is the fact that the pantry is actually the only part of the house that is still standing and she told me that she is very grateful to have so much community support about 20 minutes ago there was roughly about 30 residents in and around the area that came to help clean up as you can see it's going to take a lot of time but has been a lot of hands out here helping them clean up various items earlier i did speak with the grandmother of the homeowner and she was telling me that there's many items like pictures very personable items that they, of course, have lost in this storm. And they just gave tears of gratitude to just be alive in this moment. But as you can see, there is so much damage in and around. There is metal from a chicken coop that's actually across the field over there in their backyard now. There are several trees that are down, and there's even power lines that are laying on the ground actually right next to us. We had to be very careful as we were coming in because there are several power lines lines that first responders that we spoke with earlier told me that they were actually down when they came in to rescue the Tao family. But tonight at 9, you will actually hear more from the Tao family and their story, as well as a first responder that came to help them out. But for now, Anna, I'm going to head and send it back over to you at the desk.